It's early. Um, yesterday was a long day. This is a bit of housekeeping right now um, for the beginning of the video. The video that I'm about to show you basically was filmed yesterday. The reason I didn't show it yesterday is because I got caught up um, with all the protests, some work stuff, just some other personal things and stuff of that nature. But I think it was still important to show the vlog that I had done from yesterday because actually the vlog that I did from yesterday was about something that happened the day before, but it was a good conversation that continued. The reason I think it's important to show you now is because it's about unintended consequences and, you know, the possibility of things that can happen and stuff like that. That's why this intro is probably a little bit longer than normally it is. And this is actually November 13th, 2016. The video is going to take place in November 12th, 2016. I'm still tired, so um, forgive me. And that video is actually about what happened on November 11th, 2016. Sounds complicated, but it'll make sense once you watch the other part of the video. I tell folks to be safe out there. Take care. I'll see you. God bless. They still got this thing in the hallway, man. They need to come get this. Anyway. Good afternoon, people. Good morning, whatever it is in your area. Another good day. So basically, check this out. I mean, I had this dope conversation on the train last night with a drunk white guy. It was interesting. Well, at least he sounded like he was drunk. You know what I'm saying? Could have been, you know. Um, he kind of tapped me on the shoulder because I, I was listening to my headphones, had my back turned. You know, I didn't know what it was, who it was. I thought it was somebody that knew me. I know it wasn't nobody that wanted the problems because I don't move like that in the streets. But he wanted to talk to me about Trump. <laughs> so here's this stranger on the train wanting to talk to me about the election of Trump. I was like, oh, where is this going to go? So basically the guy starts asking me, he's like, hey, man, what the hell happened? He's like, I look up and Trump's the president. I was like, I don't know, man. I mean, we were talking, and I just said, I guess it's a country divided, man. Folks wasn't sticking together. Or folks don't know what they want. Two different visions of America, you know. And he was voicing the same. He said he voted. I voted, too. What happened? But what he said next kind of threw me off. You know, not threw me off, but it was encouraging what he said next. He talked about the different type of people on the train. Black, white, Asian, Hispanic how we all together on the train. We ride the train every day. And, um, you know, it's no problems. I don't agree with not being no problems. But he was saying how maybe this election of Trump would start bringing cats together and start realizing what's important in this country and what we need to do. And um, that was encouraging. That was interesting. Basically, two strangers, one white man, one black man on the train, you know, talking about this situation that normally we probably wouldn't have talked about or we wouldn't even interact with each other. And we just had a real conversation. So who knows? Maybe there are unintended consequences, consequences of this election, good and bad. You know, let me know what you think. And uh, who knows, maybe we have a conversation in the comments.